Hello everyone and welcome back to The Breakdown. Today I'm going to be teaching you how to download and install custom Minecraft maps in Minecraft 1.14. Custom maps are really cool. They can add any of their new survival world for you, parkour, dropper maps. All of it is available and all of it is possible using custom maps here. So this is our in-depth guide on how to get them. First and foremost though, we do have a message from our sponsor, which is Apex Minecraft Hosting. Go to the first link down below, thebreakdown.xyz slash Apex to get an incredible Minecraft server for you and your friends. That is 100% DDoS protected and up 24 hours a day, 7 days a week without ever having to use a resource on your computer. One thing I do love about Apex as well is that you can import your own maps using FTP over there and you can play any of these custom maps that I show you here in this video. You can easily play them on Apex Minecraft hosting just by, by uploading the world to your server. We love Apex so much that we also host our own server there, play.breakdowncraft.com. So if you are looking for an incredible Minecraft 1.14 or any other Minecraft version server host, Apex Minecraft hosting is the one to go with. You can check them out again at the first link down below the breakdown.xyz slash Apex. Nevertheless, let's go ahead and jump on into it and get some custom maps installed in 1.14. Now, if you have a custom map like in mind already, just make sure it's from 1.14 and you'll be good to go. Otherwise, if you're looking for custom maps or if you're just looking for a new one, this is a great list on. 15 great custom maps for 114. All these are updated and rocking 114 without any problems. You can actually check out this list in the description down below. And for this video, we're going to be installing a free parkour. It's actually pretty cool because it actually implements some 114 elements and things like that. So once you're here, you can click the green download button and it takes us off to Minecraft Maps where we can get the download for this by clicking right here, the download map. So once we click on that, it will go ahead and download in the bottom left. If you're on Mozilla Firefox, it'll pop up in the center of your screen and you want to click save file. But in the bottom left it's for google chrome now if we minimize our browser here on our desktop we have a zip file dun 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 it's called freaky park warriors will be whatever your minecraft map is called now what you want to do is right click on this file and then click extract all then go ahead and click extract you don't need winrar you do not need winrar you do not need anything else except normal my like windows right you need normal windows 10 and just right click and click extract all and then you can delete this zip file you downloaded here and you should have this this like folder titled whatever your zip file was titled go ahead and open up that and then if in here you have freaky parkour or whatever the name of your map is if there's another folder in here click on it until you see this dim one data dim dash one when you see data dim one dim dash one right like this go ahead and back out one right click this back arrow right here in the top left and then drag this to your desktop right this folder right here to your desktop now you can delete the original folder that you opened and now when you open your new folder it should say data dim one dim dash one it might not have everything else but it should have data dim one and dim dash one in it as soon as you open it up if you see those folders you're good to go we can go ahead and continue if it doesn't make sure that whenever you open it you see that so just go into the next folder until you see these back out one and drag that to your desktop now at this point we can go ahead and get this installed to do this click on the top left for me it's in the bottom left of your screen that little windows icon in the bottom left there go ahead and click on that and then go ahead and type in run r-u-n exactly like that then there's this run desktop app here go ahead and click on that and then in this run desktop app type percent app data percent so percent sign app data percent sign percent app data percent right like that then go ahead and click ok now we'll open up this this is your roaming folder and here you should have a dot minecraft folder which we do and then in here you should have a saves folder which we do see that saves folder right there go ahead and open that up and here are all of the worlds you have in minecraft right so what we want to do is go ahead and drag our map right here, Freaky Parkour, over into our saves folder, right? Boom, right like so. Now, whatever map you have, go ahead and drag it over. Now, as soon as you open this, when it's in your saves folder, you should see data dim1 dim-1. If you do, you're good to go. We can now go ahead and open up Minecraft 1.14, right like so, and get things rocking and rolling. So as you can see, we are opening 1.14.1 there, and we'll be able to see that this map is set up. Now I'm going to show you what happens if you're installing like a map built for 1.14 and 1.14.1. That's the case for this map here. It's going to freak out a little bit, but I'll show you how to handle it and we'll be A-OK. -okay. So once we're on the Minecraft main menu, we'll be good to continue with the tutorial, and it looks like we are there. Look at how beautiful that is. Oh, we've got John Smith and installed as well this is beautiful but nevertheless let's go ahead and click on single player here and then here you'll find your map right so if we come down we will see freaky parkour you see that right there go ahead and double click on it now it's gonna say this world is last played in the snapshot version that snapshot version is 114 so we are good to open this in 114 you were on 114 one please make a backup now 
you do not need to make a backup because if this doesn't work, you can just go download it again, right? You've not done anything in this world. So we can just go ahead and say, I know what I'm doing, launch me on into it, and it will go ahead and open up your map. Now, 99% of the time, as long as it says like it's on our website or if it's on Minecraft maps or something like that, and it says it's 114 compatible, it is 114 compatible. And that's the case here. So as you can see, welcome to Freaky Parkour. We can then go over here and see like, you know, this map is made by Box. And then I think there's a sign Click this sign to start a parkour. So we click that sign and we can get started. I am horrible at parkour. <laughs> you can't tell I am absolutely horrible at parkour. But this is actually cool. It's got some 114 blocks in it and things like that. I'm trying to see if I can see some here. I think those are some 114 blocks right back there. So pretty cool stuff. If you did enjoy this video, you now know how to get a custom map. Please let me know in the comment section down below by saying, hey, this worked. Thank you very much. Also, if you have any questions, post those in the comment section down below. Give this video a thumbs up. And if you're looking for an incredible 1.14 grief protected survival server or an incredible custom skyblock server, come play on our server, play.breakdowncraft.com. It is the best Minecraft server in the multiverse. That's the standard we set for ourselves, and that's the standard we strive to achieve every day. So again, come play with us. Play.breakdowncraft.com is the IP. I can't wait to see you online. My name is Nick. This has been The Breakdown, and I am out. Peace.